A tasty fundraising event is taking place this week to help raise money and awareness for a community garden in Detroit's Northwest Goldberg neighborhood. The goal ultimately is to help revitalize the area and joining us this morning to talk about it more is Chef Brandon Zarb, who is uh, cooking up something amazing for us right. and Daniel A. Washington, the founder and president of Northwest Goldberg Care. So let's start with Brandon. What did you just put? What did, tell me what you're doing here. So we're making a lamb kefta tagine. It's a very traditional beautiful Moroccan dish. It's stewed lamb meatballs and tomato sauce, and we actually put fresh eggs and bake it all together. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay, so you just dumped in some peppers and yep. some onions. Green now peppers, what's... onions, uh, a little bit of chili powder and cumin, and then some fresh cilantro and Ooh, some yeah. parsley as well. Half lamb, half beef, some salt, and get it all oh. mixed up. Okay, cool. Yeah. And then how long does it take to really mash that and mix it up? Uh, you know, you just want to get it solid. And okay. In a smooth consistency, it doesn't take very long. Okay, especially for long. a pro like you who does it all the time. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> absolutely. Okay, cool. Well, as you were mixing that together and making the perfect, uh, the kafta balls, uh, what you said it's kefta or kafta? Kefta. Kefta. Okay. Yeah. Is there a tagline? Uh, well, kefta it just means minced meat. Oh. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. All right. Absolutely. I th nice. Lear learning something, and we're also learning. I want to learn more about this garden because you, this is a dish that you're making for a fundraiser this week, but ultimately this fundraiser is helping support a garden for a neighborhood. Tell me about this. Exactly. So Northwest Goldberg Cares is a 501c3 based out of Northwest Goldberg neighborhood. Last year, we launched our first neighborhood garden there and we provided residents with free produce to over 20 residents. So it was awesome. It was families, youth, elderly, the whole nine yards. Okay. So this is all produce that you grew in the garden. Yes, correct. Well, no, this isn't yeah. the produce, but the funds go to expanding that effort. So okay. this year we're looking to triple our impact on the neighborhood. So that means that getting nearly 60 families free wow. produce throughout the summer. So do people in the neighborhood help take care of the garden? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. So we have a big, uh, we have a big commitment from the uh, cadets there in our neighborhood, as well as residents who come out and actually tend the garden, as well as we improve the blocks surrounding it. So we do a lot of blight removal and we really try to improve our neighborhood one step at a time. Okay, cool. Let's check back in with our chef. All, All right. right. It looks like we've, we've got our, yeah. our kefta balls. Yep. So pre-roasted meatballs. Okay. Okay. And we have our tomato sauce. You want to warm it up a little bit and then just spoon it over. Very simple, very easy to make. Okay, so this is my plate, right? Oh, candy. no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so, so how, how is this served normally? Uh, normally, it's served family style. Okay. Um, typically, this dish is actually served with bread, okay. although rice or couscous is common. Okay, as well. cool. And I think we have a final product here, right? That's right. Is this is this it over here? That's it. Should I move it up to the center yeah. so we can reveal? Absolutely. Would you reveal? like to unveil it? <laughs> oh, I would. Lo I like unveiling. Yes. <laughs> okay. Are we ready? Yeah, we're ready. Mm -hmm. Ta -da -da. Beautiful. Wow, yeah. look how pretty. So there's eggs on it because you said you crack some eggs and then yep. you bake it. That's right. Bake it about 20 minutes. Oh my minutes. goodness. Yeah. That makes it look like it's, um, I mean, it's good for breakfast. Look, Absolutely. you guys see how pretty that is? Oh my gosh. <laughs> so you'd put the sauce on it, crack the eggs yep. and then bake it. Yep. And crack the eggs right on top. Oh just my like gosh. That. Wow. So have you learned any tricks from the chef? You know, not yet. I don't, I don't stay out of the kitchen. Because once you grow all of these veggies, you're going to have to start cooking some exactly. for yourself, right? Exactly. You're right. Okay, cool. Well, if you want to participate in this French Moroccan feast, it's all happening Wednesday, April 6th. Chef Brandon Zarb, it'll be at uh, a place called Frame, correct? Frame in Hazel Park. Okay. That's right. And that's on John R.? John R., just south of 10 Mile. Okay, cool. In Hazel Park, we're going to have this recipe, plus more on the event posted on our website. How, how much are tickets? Tickets are $50. $50, okay. Yeah. And all the proceeds go to help grow this incredible neighborhood garden that will help provide fresh produce for families there. Thank you both That's so much right. for joining us. Thank you. Thank you. All right, ready to dive in. Yeah. And uh, a new, we'll check back in with a new.